person telling them needs to say, and I know from experience, because there was a lot of things I should have done earlier that I didn't do, because I didn't have the courage, because I wasn't the man, but today I'm gonna let you borrow the courage from me, so you can go be better to her. The right person has to be a trained assassin. Go. All right, we're in an image consulting business. Okay. One of our biggest draws is when they say that they're not ready or they need to talk with their husband and they don't want to bring him in. Yeah, and number one, listen, I promise you that your husband or wife, the number one thing that do, they do want to see you do is grow in life and go in other areas. Because I'm going to tell you this, if your wife saw you get in better shape, care about yourself more, you're probably going to roll that right into her. Would you agree? Yes or no? And she knows that. Do you think your, your wife would be upset with you treating her better or coming home and looking nicer? I mean, I'm asking you, like, you made a commitment to marry her. She probably married you, right? Why? Because you promised this great, amazing life with her. Now, somewhere along the way, you've gotten comfortable you've gotten complacent, you lost your way, and guess what, man? You're wanting to go back to that because you know that she deserves it and she's your queen, am I right? You don't go ask your queen, can I be better for you, okay? Then she thinks you don't want it. It's gotta be her decision. Listen, man, you're the man. You gotta make it your decision and then she'll be proud of you for leveling, leveling up because she's worth it. Okay, does that make sense? Yeah. It's like the birthday deal. Hey babe, I don't wanna go out, it's my birthday. She does wanna go out. She's just not wanting to burden you. She wants to see if she's still important or if you're just gonna blow it off, okay? Trust me, you don't need to ask for permission to be a better man for your wife. I assure you. Thank you. Listen, but the person telling them needs to say, and I know from experience, because there was a lot of things I should have done earlier that I didn't do, because I didn't have the courage, because I wasn't the man, but today I'm gonna let you borrow the courage from me, so you can go be better to her. Okay, what credit card do you wanna put it on? <laughs> Let's go quick. Hey guys, what's going on? It's Andy. A lot of you leave comments telling me that you need help. Do me a favor and I'll tell you the best way to get a hold of me. Shoot me a text message right now, 918-210-0254. 918-210-0254. I'll help you with whatever you need. I got you back for life. Let's get back to the video. Alright, so uh, I, I sell solar and sometimes I'll run into customers that are like, uh, yeah, I think so is a good idea, but I'm Oh, no, you said I think people say I think solar is good, but what? Uh, I think solar is a good idea, but this is not going to be our forever home. We're going to be moving in two years. Yeah, hey, no, I don't want to invest in that. Well, so number one, I totally understand. The beautiful thing about solar is that solar is only going to be available for a short period right now. And we know as a homeowner, if they're going to be shopping around in two years from now, because you're going to be in the market to sell your home in two years from now, we know a homeowner is going to be looking for homes when the utility bills are through the roof that have solar. Would you agree? Yes. And since a lot of homes don't have solar on it, what is that going to make your home worth? More money, and it's going to sell faster. That's not going to upset you in two years when you're ready to sell it, is it? No. Let's go ahead and take care of this. That way you start enjoying the benefits now and it'll be easy to sell when you're ready. Okay, number one, uh, am I showing up or is, is the other guy showing up? Uh, just say you set the appointment and then you're going to show back up. Okay, well, hey, number one, listen, when I meet you, I'm just going to say, what's your name? Ben. Ben? Yes. Ben, I just want to take, number one, you got a family? I don't. You don't have a family, but you got a, you got a nice home. Yes. Most people have families with nice homes. Right. Okay, or or they really prioritize their time really well and you do big shit because you got a beautiful home. Would you agree? Thank you. Yeah. Okay, the fact that I'm here today, I want to explain this to you. I've got three kids at home and I've got an amazing wife. The reason why I got in solar is because I love helping people. I love it. I promise you you're gonna think about me in five years from now when you see what's going on in the economy and you see the decision that we made together. Now I need you to know something. My company tries to set appointments with me all day long to sit down, because I'm a solar expert, right, um, with homeowners like yourself. I'm going to do something, but I'd like the favor in return. We're gonna lock down 6 p.m. for tomorrow night. I'm gonna ensure that I block off so my company does not set an appointment with me because I want to be the person to sit down with you face to face. I've already been speaking with you for the last 15 minutes. I like you, you said you have an amazing wife, I can't wait to meet her. You have a beautiful home and it seems like you've got a great family. Sir, it'd be my honor to come back tomorrow night at 6 p.m. and actually me physically spend, uh, sit and spend time with you. Would that be okay? 
so that we don't have someone else come out. Let's make an agreement together, a gentleman's agreement. Not only are we going to lock an appointment, let's, let's do a handshake that we will both, no matter what, not let anything interfere with this 6 p.m. appointment tomorrow night. I'm also going to put my family to the side. I'm going to block off the appointments, and I'm going to make sure that nothing's more important than you and your family. Is that fair? That's fair. That mother will show up. But listen, you have to tie that in. What did I say? It'd be my honor to serve you. So that someone else doesn't have to show up. I want to make sure I block off my schedule so that I'm here with you. Most of the time, there will be someone else showing up. But you know what? Because I met you, I like the way you operate. I see you like you're an amazing man. I would like to spend more time with me. And I think I'll book my slot for me to come back and meet with you personally. I don't do this often, but on this occasion, I would like to be the one to serve you. Is that fair, sir? See, see, see. You get to paint the picture. Whatever you want it to look like. It's a, it's a perspective. Does that make sense? Yes. Okay. Guys, listen. Really quick. We could go forever. Okay, go. We'll go with you and we're done because she's got a baby. <laughs> so, we sell building materials mm -hmm. uh, to roofing contractors mainly. So, when we go to their offices, um, we try to go through the door and we're like, hey, we'll prefer roofing supply. And usually they're like, no, we're fine. We're good where we're at. They don't even give us the time to waste. So how would you approach that situation? Yeah, so number one, I don't know who services your accounts, but what we've learned and research shows is that a lot of people assume they're going to get all your business, and there's a lot of additional perks and benefits that your company could be receiving from companies like ours, but you don't know about it because a lot of times we're closed mind because we're so loyal. Now I want to ask you, there's been a lot of changes in this industry. Whoever that you do business with, this place you already have, are they coming in here with you right now and explaining all the changes and all the savings that you could have and how much easier things are? Or have they not done their job and come back in? I'm not talking badly about anybody, but I want to tell you why our company is sweeping the area is because we have a certified specialist, right? Uh, uh, customer service that stays weekly in front of our clients to ensure that they're up to date on all the money they can save, the, the faster technology that's out to make sure that you can get your supplies, and plus what your company likes most so we can keep make sure that we keep that on order. Now I will tell you this, what we've learned is that a lot of people when getting big accounts, which you seem like a big account, they disappear and just take the dough. That's not loyal to you. What I hear is you're being loyal to them, and I want to ask you a simple question. If you don't feel like they're being as loyal to you as possible. I don't want you to switch. I don't want you to make a decision, but I would like to at least set an appointment and go over what we do. And in the end, it's completely your decision. And I'll be happy to walk out here if you're not interested. Would that be fair? See, notice I said, I said that you are being loyal to them, but I bet they're not being as loyal back to you. And then they say, well, yeah, I really have it. Because don't most people lock down big accounts and disappear? Yes. You no, right? So see, I'm going to... Yes, I'm going to hit them and I'm going to say there's a lot of things that have changed that you're probably not aware of and a lot of big accounts get locked down and people disappear and you just keep paying them, okay? Listen to me. The person that you're loyal to needs to be just as loyal to you. So we can ensure that loyalty is going both ways and it's a two-way street. Would you mind if we sit down for 15 minutes, I'll set up a time and go over what it looks like in our company and then the ensure decision. I won't talk you out of anything and if you want to know more, I'll be happy to give it. See, we need to get to the table with the decision makers and then they're going to tell us how to sell them, am I right? Hey guys, I just want to tell you, you're the true one percenters. You made it till the end of the video. Do me a favor, share it with the friend that wants to go to another level. Make sure you like the video, comment below so I know who you are. Set your notifications and then subscribe to the channel. We got daily sales training videos dropping. I'll see you soon.